All right, watch. I have a little piece of paper. I'm going to take the paper and tear it in half. Tear it up a little more. Take the pieces and tear them up. And this is something that's kind of weird to do, but I'm going to do it so I don't get freaked out about it. I'm going to take it and place it in my mouth. Watch. of a dozen, okay? Yes, you use one up every time. No, you can't wrap it back up again. I guess you could, but that'd be kind of tough to do. And so, it comes a dozen in a pack. And I use the Jack Miller brand. Nothing against the other guy. I just like Miller's for a couple of reasons. One, they come with the little slip of paper you tear up, okay? Which is not even the perfect size and the perfect weight and everything for doing this. And, uh, and also, they do not, the colors do not go from the, from the coal, do not rub off onto your mouth. And some other brands do that, so now you got purple and red or green or something on your lips or in your tongue. Uh, and I just don't like that. So a couple of things you've been doing this, you get a little coal here. And I'll get a little piece of paper. And yes, I'm exposing the trick to you. But you can't do it, you got to buy these. So you got to you got to have this to do it, otherwise you can't do it. So you can try to make these all day long. It won't work. So they come coil like this, and it pulls out this way. Before you start the show, you pull it out a little bit, okay? And you put it back in again, so this is kind of hanging out there. The reason you do that is if you put this in your mouth, and you do have the option, you don't have to put it in your mouth. You can tear the pieces up and just put them in your hand and pull it up like this out of your hand. You could do that. But the mouth is just so much funnier, and people, it really gives a great reaction. So you pull it out a little bit like that, okay? All right? And then you hide the, the coil behind the piece of paper in your hand. This is no big deal. You just, now, a couple of things when doing this, don't tear the paper, you know, like this, because then they see it, so don't do that. So tear the paper, pull this dead still, tear the paper off like this, and then you can take it put it behind it, like that, see? And then you end up with all the pieces like this. So let me get back a little bit. Now you take all the pieces and you want to put this in your mouth and you want to put the starting piece, okay, obviously facing outside of your mouth, facing out from the mouth, okay? Otherwise it's difficult. Because if you don't, and also by pulling that out again, the saliva, when you put that in your mouth, the saliva sometimes solidifies the paper and you can't get it going. And I've had it happen before. And it, uh, it's quite hilarious for the audience and quite ridiculous for the magician. So anyway, so you put this in your mouth and then you start pulling on it, okay? And uh, that's it. The mouth pulls. They come in a dozen. Don't be afraid of this. This thing is a funny bit to do. Uh, you know, funny stories. I know how you feel about being conservative. And I, when I got my first package, I let it sit there for months. Because I was like, I don't want to waste them. So anyway, so I went ahead and did it and, uh, and practiced it one time. Obviously, you need to practice it. But it was one of the best things I ever did. And I practically do it almost every show, depending on the audience. And it gets a great reaction. So mouth coils, buy some. You'll enjoy it. Also, we do carry some of the mouth coils that are, look like money coming out of your mouth. In the colors of money. And uh, we also carry those. But my number one seller is just the regular mouth coils. This is great. Get one. You'll love it. Kids shows, everything, anything. Adults, they all love it. Mouth goes.